Wow. <laughs> Sedap dah. <laughs> so good. Dia light. <laughs> so good. Hey guys, it's Zach again, back again with another e-juice review uh, from Cigaro Vape Store uh, Malaysia. And today we have a very exciting juice lineup. Uh, we have the Crisp Breakfast Series. Now this is owned by Nasty Juice, so I expect a really, really high quality US grade flavor from this. Uh, as usual, as you guys know, um, we want you guys to keep in, in your mind, in the back of your head that uh, this is a 100% unpaid review. And uh, whatever I say within this video may not necessarily cater towards your flavor profiles, because again, everyone has their own flavor profiles everyone likes certain things and different things so whatever I say on this um, video do not take it a hundred percent for granted or anything so the three flavors that we're actually gonna review today is the crisp skippy jam crisp berry crunch and the crisp fruit pebbles these sound really amazing they're all breakfast items that I personally love so much so so much and uh, yeah let's just get right into it uh, first of all uh, as usual we're gonna be talking about the setup that I'll be using for this review and slight change instead of the uh, my usual setup we're actually using the new Druga Foxy the sexy little mod as you guys can see that really sexy sleek and then we can have uh, we're using the usual Athena RDA dripper by, by Geek Vape uh, the coil build that I'll actually be using is the standard uh, creamy build 26 gauge Kenthal on both coils uh, 2.5 diameter 6 loops should give you around 0 0.3 ohms around that part Perfect for these creamy liquids. So let's get right into it. A close up of the Skippy Jam. All right, so here we have a nice little close up on the crisp Skippy Jam, uh, the entire packaging. So let's just get right into it. So in the very front, you can see it's a very nice minimalistic art. You have the nice little circle here with your um, peanut butter uh, art and everything. Bottom over here, you have your VG PG ratios, everything like that. Uh, nice little logo. Take a look at the side over here. You can see this their website. In the back, you have all the boring manufacturing details, all that stuff. Yep, and then again on the side, you have a nice little uh, slogan, whole breakfast guarantee. Well, we'll be the judge of that, we'll see in a bit. Uh, so yeah, let's just crack this open. You can see, nice little packaging. Ooh, beautiful bottle. Just close that up. I'm sure you guys can see that. Uh, here we go, here's a nice little bottle. Uh, really nice, if you can look at the sides here. Again, you have your manufacturing detail and everything like that. Um, really nice um, packaging. As you can see, they're using the new gor uh, Chubby Gorilla version 2, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, for those of you guys out there who can't tell the difference, um, as you can see, they've uh, innovated in a sense, a new type of O-ring here, uh, which uh, doesn't actually fall off. I'm not sure if you guys saw our previous video, but there was this one time, I think it was the uh, Freezy Tricks Extreme where the O-ring actually fell out, uh, but yeah. We won't be having that problem anymore because of this new uh, o-ring that doesn't fall out. Uh, again, with the chubby bottles, you can tell if they're real or fake uh, by actually squeezing them. You can see this is quite soft, it gives way when you press it. A lot of the clones out there, they're quite um, hard and very stiff. So yeah, that's one way you can tell between um, the bottles of the Chubby Gorilla, whether they're fake or if they're original. So yeah, as you guys can see, really nice packaging over here. Really sleek design, everything. Great job by Crisp. Uh, so yeah, let's get right into the flavor profile. Let's test it. All right, so that was a nice little in-depth view for you guys for the actual bottle and the packaging and everything. So let's get into the highly anticipated part, actually trying the liquid. Now, first of all, this Chris series as a whole is quite new in Malaysia um, and actually relatively new in the entire market. Uh, it's rare to find these kind of Skippy Jam, Berry Crunch and Fruit Pebble-like uh, breakfast kind of items. So I'm really, really excited. So without further ado, let's get right into trying it. So here we go. Here's the Chris Skippy Jam. Let's crack that bad boy open. Oh, that, that beautiful sound and opening a new bottle. Beautiful, beautiful. Music to my ears. As you can see, again, this is using the new Chubby Gorilla version two. All right, all right, so let's just give it a try. Let's put it right on our cottons. Get real nice and saturated. Ooh, the smell on that. Wow. Really, really strong. All right, make it really nice and wet. Give it a short little pre-fire. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but I'm actually vaping this at 45 watts on the Juga Foxy. Should you see that? All right, here's a little pre-fire. Beautiful. Let's cap that off. So I forgot to mention, but I'm actually vaping this at 6 mg for all um, flavors. So let's give it a try. Wow. 
Wow. Amazing, amazing flavor. If you guys have seen my flavor, uh, my flavor reviews, see, it's so good I can barely even talk. But if you guys have seen my um, previous reviews, you know that I love when they, uh, when brewers actually combine both fruity and creamy flavors together. Now this flavor specifically really, really catches my eye because I think it's been around two or three years I've been going around trying to find the perfect uh, peanut butter and jam, um, sorry, peanut butter and jelly type uh, flavor. And this hits the spot perfectly. Let's give it another try. Wonderful vapor production, wonderful. But yeah, you can really taste that peanut butter, which acts as an undertone. It really has that really thick, creamy uh, throat hit, which you really want. And then there's a little, little sprinkle on the overtones of that decorative um, jam, strawberry jam, I'm not quite sure. Can't really put my uh, tongue on it, but let me try again. Yeah, it's definitely some sort of a, ooh, some residual smoke. Um, yeah, there's definitely some sort of hint of strawberry jam as the overtone. I'm not sure if it's strawberry or blueberry, but there's some sort of fruitiness at the very um, top that's decorating it. It's beautiful, really, really nice, really well balanced. Inhalation, exhalation periods are perfect. Um, really, really sweet, really nice and perfect. Perfect for you guys who love the combination of fruity and creamy. So let's get into the next one. Uh, the next uh, e-liquid that we're actually gonna review today is the Crisp Berry Crunch. Now this is again another cereal type uh, based. So let's have a quick close up on it. All right, so next we have the Crisp Berry Crunch. Uh, so straight off the bat, I didn't mention the previous one, but actually the uh, packaging on this is your standard uh, cardboard or paper boxing um, at like kind of superficial value. You can't really, there's nothing really special about it, but um, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see when it comes to the flavor testing to see how good this flavor actually is. Uh, again, in the very front, you have your minimalistic design, again, with the circle and nice little art there. Uh, again, you have your logo up here, your VGPG ratios and all that stuff. Uh, the side, again, you have their website, uh, chrisbrew.com. Uh, again, in the back, you have your manufacturing um, information and your nicotine strength and all that stuff. Uh, and then again, you have the slide slogan, uh, whole breakfast guaranteed. So yeah, let's just crack this open again. Oh, something, another nice touch is at the very top. I forgot to mention that in the previous one, but as you can see here, it's a really nice, uh, again, minimalistic design. Let's open it up. Beautiful. Right, so here's a nice little look at the bottle itself. Again, same design for all of them. You have your same logo, everything like that. Uh, manufacturing details in the back, uh, your nicotine strength and all that. Again, it's using the um, Chubby Gorilla bottle. Really nice, uh, really durable, really flexible, all that kind of stuff. Here's a nice look at the little bottom. Not much to see there, but yeah, it's really nice liquid. So yeah, let's get right into the next one. All right, so that was a nice little insight onto the Berry Crunch from Crisp. So let's just give it a try. Uh, first of all, I want to give huge kudos, huge mad respect to the Crisp uh, Brewers. They're really making movements out here. They're making, I think, possibly one of my favorite liquids right now. Uh, these taste really, really nice. And I think they're kind of under hype right now. There's no, no fake hype or anything. No one's like, they're not being paid to, um, what, do you, what do you call it? Mm. It's one of those things where companies, you know, they generate so much hype out of nothing. But this one, the hype, is deserved it's very well deserved because these flavors i mean so far they're really really nice so let's get right into the next one the crisp berry crunch all right let's open it up give it a nice shake you guys can hear that again breaking the seal nice little try berry crunch i presume this is a, a cereal with some sort of berry again Really high expectations for this. All right, let's give it a nice little pre-fire. Oh. Beautiful. Just from the smell alone, ooh, this is gonna be a good liquid. Let's give it a try. Wow. First thing, straight off the bat, I can really tell uh, Berry Crunch sort of represents that flavor of uh, Captain Crunch cereal, if you guys have had that. I'm not sure if a lot of you guys have had that or not, but it's really, really nice. 
uh, you can really taste the berryness. Uh, I'd actually compare this, uh, if you want to compare it to another flavor on the market, uh, the Jamberry Pancake by the Mad Alchemist. This is quite similar to that, except it doesn't have that very uh, thick and fatty throat hit that you usually have with the Jamberry Pancake. This one, um, it really emphasizes on the fruitiness of the liquid. Really, really nice, but the cereal undertone is still there. You can still taste the cerealness and the milkiness. However, uh, it's not as strong as I would like it, but overall still a really great flavor. Let's try it again. Again, really great uh, vapor production. All these flavors are actually 70-30 VGPG. Uh, so if you actually follow my build that I said earlier on in the video, this is perfect for cloud chasing as you guys can see. Perfect for cloud production, perfect vapor, produ sorry. perfect vapor production, and perfect flavor, that perfect balance. So let's move on to the next flavor, which is the Fruits Pebbles. So let's have a nice little insight. All right, so next we have the Fruity Pebbles box. Again, it's the same thing as the other ones. You have your minimalistic idea. They kind of have this um, blue circle thing around here. Really nice, really nice contrasting um, to kind of indicate the fruitiness of this flavor. Uh, again, you have your uh, information about VGPG ratios and all that stuff. Uh, their website, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, and then you have the manufacturing detail and all that stuff. Um, again, their slogan, whole breakfast guaranteed. Let's just take a real nice look at it. Open it up. So here we go. Again, same kind of uh, style, as you guys can see. Really, really nice. Again, Chubby Gorilla bottle, everything like that. It's really, really nice, uh, really sleek, really professional. Great job by Chris Brew. Uh, actually, I forgot to check on the other ones. Maybe there might be a sticker. Sometimes there's a manufacturer's give it a little surprise. And okay, there's nothing in there. Got excited for a second. I thought there was, but looks like there isn't. <clears throat> but other than that, yeah, really nice. So let's get into tasting it. And we're back. Okay, so perfect. Next, we're gonna just straight away and try the Fruits Pebble. Again, 6MG. Let's crack this bad boy open. Nice little shake, crack that seal open. Oh, perfect. Nice little shake. As usual, saturate our cottons. Alright. Straight off the bat, that smells completely different. Oh, forgot to give you guys a small little pre-fire. Look at that. Look at that vapor production. Cap it off. Let's give a small little try. Guys, I think I found my new favorite liquid. Wow, this really tastes like Fruity Pebbles cereal. Exactly, pound for pound, exactly the same. This is amazing. Um, the cerealness and the fruitiness, perfect balance between the inhalation and exhalation periods. They're both balanced, really sweet, really nice, mild throat hit. Uh, perfect for those people who are trying to cloud chase uh, without getting too much strain on their throat. Really, really nice. Again, kudos, kudos to the Crips um, Brewers. I don't know how they managed to actually take the entire cereal and put it into a bottle just right for you. And I, I'm mind boggled right now. These are amazing flavors. Uh, really, really nice, really sweet. I'm gonna hit it again. Wow, really, really nice. Um, all right, I think that's all for today's review. Um, overall summary, we um, reviewed the crisp breakfast series we tried the skippy jam the berry crunch and the fruits pebble uh, now if I had to choose one oh this is hard this is really hard Oof. fruits pebble definitely hands down at first I really thought the skippy jam was the best one but this really takes the cake perfect perfect e-liquid really emphasizes the entire fruity pebble um, fruity pebbles uh, cereal it's amazing really nice uh, as usual, don't forget to subscribe to Cigarro Vape Store, our YouTube channel, our Instagram. We really, really appreciate those people who subscribe. Make sure you guys comment down below on anything like any mods we should review, any liquids we should review, or any builds I should try. I'm sure we'll take that into consideration. So I'll see you guys next time.
拜。